arrow speed moves in. They're set. Away and running. Good speed today from Smooth Player, but Poppy's Revenge takes an uncontested lead with a circuit of the track to go, and Eddie Felsen now moves into that second place position. Smooth Player travels well enough in third, evasive moves at the fence, and a very wide arrow speed is last of all. So that's the quintet as they pass the seven for long point, and Poppy's Revenge with the mouth open has the lead of the six and a half for long point, and has a nice and relaxed lead too, and it's only a length. Smooth Player's right there upping the stakes in second, and Arrow Speed continues this wide journey down the back of the track. Eddie Felsen's right there on hold in that fourth place position, and Evasive Moves needs to pick it up from last because there's no pace on whatsoever with five furlongs left to go. And Poppy's Revenge trying to slow this field down to an absolute crawl leads three quarters of a length, but Eddie Felsen rides that rail to take that second place position away, and Smooth Players battling hard in third. Arrow Speed is hit, caught wide once once again, and under the whip, evasive moves is last of all. Three furlongs to go. Poppy's Revenge has called the shots. Now picking up velocity is arrow speed. Eddie Felsen rides the rail on the other two of little consequence. The quarter pole looms, and Poppy's Revenge has something saved for the final quarter of a mile. Leads by one. Two of them chase every step of the way. Eddie Felsen and arrow speed. Heads turn for home. Poppy's Revenge has given them plenty to think about today. Arrow speed Speed trades jabs with Eddie Felsen for the second place position, but pouring it on at 3-1, to one, Poppy's Revenge looked like a winner when the starter pressed the button today. Poppy's Revenge in a polishing win over Eddie Felsen, Arrow Speed, Evasive Moves, and Smooth Player was the last one home. If you want more horse racing content, make sure you click out our brand new website.